Also die SCA ist ein weltweit operierendes Unternehmen. Ja. SCA ist eine globally operierende Company. Wir sind in verschiedene Divisionen, wo wir individuelle Produkte produzieren. Hier in Neuss wir manufacturen wir Tissue-Produkte. At this location, we produce the new Tempo brand product, toilet paper. This is our new focus in this division. This toilet paper is something new for us. With four individual unwinds, with flexible embossing technology and state-of-the-art control technology, something we haven't had in this form in the factory. That means that previous machines were not networked to the same extent, like this machine, for example, via Profinet. Futura was the first supplier who suggested basing the whole system on Synamics. We used the same technology corresponding with other suppliers to implement the design and have as few spare parts as possible. As we agreed on the Siemens standard for all three manufacturers, we have the advantage that we can keep our working capital low, especially in the storeroom. We use the same line modules, the same power modules everywhere, and the same servo motors as well. And after we received the spare parts list from the suppliers, it was easy to see that we didn't need to use 45 different motors in this line, but that we could rely on one standard. In my opinion, the advantage for our staff is that they don't have to familiarize themselves with three different technologies, but rather have one standard. For the logic part, we have an S7 CPU. The individual aggregates have their own control unit and are then connected to the Synamics axes and do the whole computation for the servo parts and for the virtual axis in the machine. And this virtual master is responsible for displaying the line speed and for transferring it to a real servo axis. The operator can enter slip value, leading and lagging values of every single roll directly on the multi-panel without stopping the machine, and in this way react to quality defects. The highlight of this machine is the interaction between every servo axis as a whole. The single unwinding transports the paper into the first embossing station where so-called pre-embossing is undertaken. This generates a certain thickness and softness in the paper. In this embossing and laminating station, the actual decoration is put onto the paper and it does the gluing at the same time as well. In the next station, the embossing or the bonding of the layers, the perforation of the actual layers and the final paper gluing takes place. The next step is temporary storage, in the so-called log storage. Afterwards, everything is transported to a saw to cut the final toilet paper rolls out of the logs. After that, these single rolls are delivered to the foil wrapping machine via a four-track system. There, the toilet paper rolls are shrink-wrapped in packages. Then we can choose whether we go straight to the palletizer or use a converter, which shrink-wraps the individual packages in bags and then delivers them to the palletizer. The immense innovation of this machine is its precision. For example, we have now installed a new saw which can work completely with this kind of modern drive technology. That means that the Tempo logo is always in the center of the roll. And this is only possible with high precision drives which are able to position exactly and are timed to each other accordingly. The fact that the number of cycles that are possible now were not achievable previously is only possible in combination with this drive technology.